This is the Ford model of public safety answering point project. The owner of the project is Municipality of City of San Antonio, General Constructor is Sound Construction, and Architect is HOK. The project site is located in 8039 Challenger Drive, San Antonio, Texas. The scope of the project is to build a new 911 emergency call center for City of San Antonio. The presented colors are green for construction process, red for demolishing, and purple for temporary structures. After demolishing two existing buildings and fencing around the project, the new building excavation will be performed and piles would be casted in place. Piles of lower foundation level in the main hall and the equipment gallery will go first and then the higher level in north and south. While pile work for north and south regions are in progress and piles are ready in east and west regions, after placing form works, concrete beams for west and then east foundation would be poured. By placing the pan joists and the slab form works for these two fields, pouring the slab starts. When the slabs of east and west parts are ready, the form works and concrete pouring in north and south regions for concrete beams and then foundation slabs would begin one after the other. The form works would be removed from each section when concrete has reached proper strength. Placement of precast external walls begins from south. The tilt-up bracing supports would be removed after completion of each part. Main entrance and main hall steel structure would be started while the external walls are in progress. After these two, prefabricated trusses would be placed and after west trusses, the equipment yard would be built. Inner wall erection is also starting from south and continues to west, north and then east. The same order is for placing the roof structure which starts after truss placement in each side. The main entrance roof structure will almost be done simultaneously with north roofing structure. After finishing the inner walls in each side, putting the ceiling of each room in that area would be done. The glass curtain wall located in the north side will be started right after completing the main entrance roof structure and then the curtain wall in the south side will be started. When the inner wall of each area has been done, HVAC and electrical works start. This sequence is also starting from south and continues clockwise to the other parts. By completing the main hall access floor by placing the pedestal tube supports on the lower one, the raised floor located in the middle could be started and boundary glass wall would be placed. When all the external walls as well as inner walls are done, windows and doors of the building would be installed. When the outer works of the building is done and the inside works are in progress, works on landscaping can be started. These works can be listed as access road and parking lot asphalting, electrical works and lightning, sidewalks, tree and grass planting and finally removing fence for delivering the project to the owner.